Hi guys. Today we will analyze 3M stock and calculate its intrinsic value using two different valuation models. Enjoy. Hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. Technical analysis. The long-term trend is still negative, but the short-term trend is neutral. It is advised to wait to see how this turns out. Support level is around $170. Resistance level is around $182. The stock is currently trading in the lower part of its 52-week range. The S&P 500 index however is trading in the upper part of its 52-week range, so the stock is lagging the market. Intrinsic value Buy low, sell high. We have heard it many times before. But how to know when it's low, and when it's high? The intrinsic value of a stock, is its true value. It refers to what a stock is actually worth, even if some investors think it's worth a lot more than that amount. Intrinsic value is important, because it can help investors understand whether the cost of a stock is undervalued, or overvalued compared to the market value of the stock. Let's calculate the stock's intrinsic value. For more accurate results, we will use two different valuation models to calculate the intrinsic value of the stock. Discounted free cash flow model, using the formula below, then, Valuation based on earnings per share, 5 year average PE ratio, and expected growth rate. First model Discounted free cash flow valuation. This spreadsheet contains some financial data that we will use for the stock valuation. We see that the average revenue growth rate of the stock has been around 3% per year, for last 5 years. We see that the average profit margin of the stock has been around 16% per year, for last 5 years. Also we see that the average free cash flow to net income rate of the stock, has been around 108% per year, for last 5 years. And we expect 8% per year average stock market return. Now, let's consider 3 different scenarios for 3M company, bad, average, and good. First scenario. 3M will have bad performance in next 5 years, and we will use the following parameters in our calculation. Future revenue growth rate would be low, minus 3%. Future profit margin would be low, 12%. Future free cash flow to net income rate would be low, 95%. In this case, the fair value of the stock today would be $131. The second scenario. 3M will have average performance in next 5 years, and we will use the following parameters in our calculation. Future revenue growth rate would be average, 3%. Future profit margin would be average, 14%. Future free cash flow to net income rate would be average, 102%. In this case, the fair value of the stock today would be $203. The third scenario. 3M will have high performance in next 5 years, and we will use the following parameters in our calculation. Future revenue growth rate would be high, 8%. Future profit margin would be high, 16%. Future free cash flow to net income rate would be high, 110%. In this case, the fair value of the stock today would be $303. Second model. Valuation based on earnings per share. This spreadsheet contains another financial data that we will use for the stock valuation. The current earning per share price for 3M is 10.11. Minimum rate of return. I will use 12%. Because when we invest in individual companies, we are looking for a higher return than the S&P 500. We take higher risk, so, we want to get higher rewards. For 3M, Analysts forecast growth rate around 8.33% per year in next 5 years, and future PE around 22. Again, I will use 3 different scenarios for 3M company, bad, average, and good. First scenario. 3M will have bad performance in next 5 years, and we will use the following parameters in our calculation. Future growth rate would be low, minus 3%. Future PE would be low, 18%. In this case, the fair value of the stock today would be $50. Second scenario. 3M will have average performance in next 5 years, 
and we will use the following parameters in our calculation. Future growth rate would be average, 3%. Future PE would be average, 22%. In this case, the fair value of the stock today would be $105. Third scenario. 3M will have high performance in next 5 years, and we will use the following parameters in our calculation. Future growth rate would be high, 8%. Future PE would be high, 26%. In this case, the fair value of the stock today would be $189. As you can see, today the stock is fairly valued, $173, if we expect 3M's high performance in future. My thoughts. It's a good company based on its fundamentals. And the stock is very priced. I own the stock and I'll buy more if it drops below $150. Company Strengths 3M has a return on assets of 12.37%. This is amongst the best returns in the industry. 3M has a profit margin of 16.90%. This is amongst the best returns in the industry. Return on equity of 41.29% is amongst the best returns of the industry. The company is financially healthy and should not expect problems in meeting its short-term obligations. The debt-to-equity ratio is in line with the industry averages. The company has been paying a good dividend, 3.3% in 2021, for at least 10 years, so it has a reliable track record. Risks Primary risks facing 3M are cyclical demand and capital-intensive manufacturing operations. At least 65% of revenue comes from cyclical end markets. The revenue has been growing slightly by 3% on average over the past five years. Based on estimates for the next five years, the company will show a small growth in revenue. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel.